everyone. If you're here and you're on my channel, it's because you love all things bougie on a budget. Hi, my name is Jaquara. We have DHgate links down below. Just download the DHgate app and click on my links for the latest bags that are in style right now. So guys, I have a lot of things that I haven't shared with you that I want to share. And I'm trying to decide if I want to put it all in one video or just do three or four different videos today and break it up. I think I definitely want to break the videos up. So let's go ahead and do that. So the first video I have for you today is this beautiful bag. I got dressed up to show you guys this. I put on my best to show you guys this. So I'm so nervous. This bag is um, another vintage from eBay. No, a vintage from Poshmark. It was not a um, $500, so it was not authenticated. And this is how she wrapped it up. So I have been purchasing on Poshmark. Um, I don't love it because I have seen scammers on there, but sometimes you can't find what you're looking for on some of the other websites and you can find it on eBay because eBay is more um, private sellers and the other places are more like, um, you know, businesses. So I think we've gotten this part open. So we're gonna try to come in from this side. I'm cutting myself. I'm try to come in from this side. Okay, she wrapped it up really nicely in a bubble wrap, guys. I'm really <laughs> nervous about this. Oh, why did she stick a screw in here? That's a little spooky. Oh, and there's a thank you note. No, it says thank you. I'm gonna show you guys the outside. Thank you. Yes. Thank you for your purchase. I hope it brings you the joy it has brought me. God bless. So nice. All right, so she wrapped it up nicely and has bubble wrap. Sorry guys, it's like, as soon as I go to do these videos, here comes my allergies. Maybe it's like nervousness, some nervous tick. <laughs> All right, so, girl, she taped this thing up something bubbly. So you guys see the bag and you see what brand it is. I think I talked about this in my last video. Who can guess what it is? It is a Gucci bag and it looks pretty authentic to me. It looks pretty old. This is vintage if I didn't mention. Here is the handle. You guys won't believe this. This, this shocked me. When I saw this, I was so shocked you guys see the handle and it's not as bad as she thought and guess what you think it is you see the gucci on the side oh it's nice and clean and pretty let's just toss that back and it is the vintage gucci atache and it is in better condition than what i thought it's nice and stiff and quality. Now, they're saying this bag is from 1947 on the websites. They're trying to say it's from like the 40s, but I doubt that this is a 40s bag. I'll try to ask her what year it is that I purchased it from, but I believe it is a 1990s bag. Here's the Gucci clip. And the ring that it attaches to, let's see how it works. It's so stiff though. It's not, I'm sure it's not as pliable as the new one. And it just clips right into there. And I guess you wear it like this. Let me bring the camera down. Awesome, Cause you guys are always getting a picture of my son. And so I guess you wear it down like this. Or you can hand up, carry it by this part. So this is, I'll insert a picture of the new Gucci Atachi. 
This is the new one going for 2980. This is the one I would have gotten cuz I love the strap. I wanted the brown, but I don't like the orange strap that goes with it, 2980, and this is the one that I really really wanted that's like 4000 that you can only find in some stores. It's sold out. It was $4000. All three of these also come with a leather strap. Of course, that one is a coated canvas. And this one is just canvas, no coat. And this was designed by Tom Ford. Designed by Tom Ford. So I can tell she's cleaned this up really nicely. She's washed it. It's so stiff. Um, she said that this strap was painted over and so it has cracks. But um, from a far away, I don't think it's, it's noticeable. And these straps, this strap is actually better than um, my MCM strap. If you haven't seen my vintage MCM review, make sure you check that out. Let's look at the inside. Oh, she gave me a bracelet. How sweet was that? Oh my God, I have to really thank her. You guys, make sure you take the time out to subscribe to my channel. I do this. This is a lot of work to find these vintage pieces for you guys and let you guys know what's out there. And you can support me and show me your appreciation by liking and subscribing to my channel and sharing it with your family and friends. So let's look at the inside. And it is like new. I believe this is smaller than the Gucci Atachis that, that is out now, but they do have a small size. The larger size is what I was looking at. And um, there is no, yeah, there is a pocket in here. And there's the Gucci, um, can you guys see that? There's a Gucci tag. And the pocket is, you know, and this is a nice um, quality inside i think it's like a nylon it's nice and quality and, it's, and the zipper pull says gucci let's see if we can find the day code she told me they're on the back so i don't know how to read gucci's day codes but i'll tell you guys what it says and those of you who know how to read it it says 001-3341 and then underneath it says 344 so if you can tell me how to read that, I'd appreciate it. So I know what year this bag is. But yes, guys, to me, she's like new. There's nothing wrong with her. The strap is a little cracked, but she's fine. Let you see the leather around the edges, I think are pretty good. I mean, from far away, I don't think anyone is going to be able to tell. And yes, this is Tom Ford, and it was $385, and I believe the new Atachi is $4,000. The one I wanted was $4,000. It had different, three different patterns on it. And of course, this one only comes with one strap. I probably won't be, yeah, I won't be doing crossbody. The new one, I think, does crossbody more comfortably. Um, kind of chubby. So this one comes with just this one strap. You can't detach it, but you do get that nice green and red around the side. Okay, let me know what you think of my vintage piece. I'll talk to you all later. Bye.